military, whatever few are left that are going to side with the people that are standing there holding candles and banging pots and pants and expressing the will of the people. That you military personnel and you people with guns and badges and law enforcement will succumb to the will of the people. And ultimately, we demand, we absolutely demand that the criminals, the criminals in this country, if you want them held accountable, the criminals are Barack Obama, Eric Holder, Susan Rice, all this entire criminal cabal that, that came about as a result of the murder of John F. Kennedy. The people that perpetrated the murder of John F. Kennedy, rise up to that. Military, join us and put all of them up against a concrete wall, just like Ceausescu, and do what we must do to save not just our country, the entire world. Uh, there's a right wing host Pete Santilli uh, declaring that uh, the former government officials, including the former president of the United States, should be lined up against the wall to just nice, pleasant music as they uh, walk him out of that segment. There he is talking about all these things. But then again, what I'm trying to figure out is what does this have to do with the murder of JF? K, I don't know. He's appealing to QAnon. Are they meeting up in Dallas again, waiting for him to show back up? Who knows? Actually, who cares? He's looking about murder. He's talking about going after his political enemies. Murder. He said things like this in the past as well, specifically about Pfizer and their plant, because he's all about destruction. Watch more. Filthy Pfizer Satanists, okay? Triple boosting people, bunch of satanic, chimeric parasite injecting. Uh, Snake venom peptide eugenicist, disgusting people. It's time. You know what we need to do? Um, Pfizer is just a manufacturing plant for Satan, okay? We need to shut that freaking place down. Shut it down. Destroy Pfizer now. Do it now. Do it now. Go over the wall. Get into their freaking buildings. Unplug all their freaking equipment. Let's go. It's time to storm. The Bastille, is it not? Mm. Huh? Oh, that's illegal. Really? They're killing people and bragging about it and sponsoring this freaking crap right here. They should be shut down for sponsoring this level of Satanism that should never occur here on Earth. Pfizer corporatism must be destroyed. Glebe, what's wrong with this guy? But I'm uh, sorry, my first problem with him is he... His rants apparently are written very clearly on his computer. Shut down <laughs> Pfizer. Jump the wall. Like, bro, come on. Like, those are straightforward lines. I think you could remember your violent lines without. Look at this. It's, it's yeah. every. Couldn't he work on words. that eye line a little bit? Move the computer monitor <laughs> nearer to the camera or something. Uh, it's wild. But I mean, I, I, I do grant him one point. We all do know that Obama was responsible for the assassination of JFK. Mm -hmm. That's the only way you were able to actually get to America from Kenya back in the day. You had to go from Kenya to Hawaii, but you had to stop in Dallas real quick during a parade. Um, you know, when you were a young boy, to make sure that the president was sh was was shot during a motorcade that he might not have even been alive for, or if he was, he was a tiny boy, which is the perfect excuse. You know, exactly. oh, you didn't kill JFK because. You were a little baby and or maybe not alive. I don't know the math on how old Obama is, but you get my point. Because mm -hmm. that's the way these things work. It, it, all you have to do is spew a couple random things. I was going to say what they call facts, but I don't think he even really thinks that. The point is to get this type of level of anger like flowing through you. And again, they ask why people say when Don, someone like Donald Trump tells his people, protest, 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 and they hear constantly from their, I guess their pundits, Kill, 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 jump the wall, set the place on fire, line them up against the wall and shoot. I, I, I mean, I don't know where they're getting this from. These must be lone wolves that do these types of things. They spread it to every kind of political enemy they have. And then when someone looks to arrest, which they're not going to do, uh, someone who's actually being investigated for crimes, they call it unequal justice because we live in an upside down world. JR, I can't take what you say seriously when you're the guy who killed Lincoln. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? And yeah. what and and what I've always waited for this moment to be face to face with the guy who killed Lincoln. I'm gonna say it directly to you, JR. Listen to these words very carefully and don't forget what I have to say. 
please don't do it again. <laughs> you misread that, bro. It was please do not no, I, do it again. Oh, Come on. oh, oh you're right. Jesus I'm sorry. I, I tried to take a whole line off the screen there, and it's very hard for me. It's hard to remember. I understand. 